Hello everybody, this is Phil from iPodTouchBola.com. Thank you guys for checking out this video. Today is Monday, July 27th, 2009, and today we have another hacking video for you guys. So, basically, this video is going to be more an organization of your springboard, if anything. What we're going to be doing is talking about the Winterboard Settings mod. If you see, there's the Winterboard icon right there. I'm going to be talking about how to put that winterboard icon and get rid of it and actually put it as a little section inside of your settings application. It's a very useful mod, especially if you're really, really organized and you want all of your settings in one place. This is about as close as you can get. So it's one download from Cydia, which is always really good when it's only one download and you're done. So we're going to check it out here. Let's go into Cydia. and we'll wait for that to load up now what you want to do is go to search and you want to search for winterboard and if you type in winterboard and put a space then it's basically going to be right there because only a few things are like that like the font pack and stuff but we want winterboard settings here. So, winterboard settings is available from the mod my eye repo, so you shouldn't have any problem getting the repo. All right. So, yeah. If you look at the description here, it says winterboard settings moves the control of winterboard from the winterboard application on Springboard to the settings application. It allows you to control the themes, and even whether winterboard is enabled directly in the set settings.app. By default it will also hide your winterboard icon and free up some space on your springboard. And that's a good thing for me because a lot of the themes I use you're skipping the last row. And one less icon makes one less page of blank icons in my opinion. And it's just a little better, you know. So yeah. So once you're ready to do it, just hit install. and confirm and then just let it install shouldn't take too long I am running on Wi-Fi here don't know if you can tell yeah there we go I'm running on Wi-Fi didn't take long at all now you wanna hit restart springboard and it will respring your device alright and then you will slide to unlock and you'll notice your winter war icon is now gone or it should be that's because now you can control everything winterboard from your settings app so go into your settings application scroll down and you should see winterboard and now you can choose whether to enable um, winterboard or not um, I believe that's for winterboard or not, not just the winterboard settings, but I think if you disable it, it'll disable winterboard. Not 100% sure on that, so don't like, don't like say that I'm wrong if I am. If, well, yeah, if I am wrong, please correct me in the comments, but don't be like mean about it or anything. Uh, springboard only, which allows you to make it to where only your springboard is affected, not any of your UI theme. It's just your icons and your wallpaper which actually does help free up memory and stuff and it helps it move a little faster um, you have themes here and that's just like the themes in the normal winterboard application you have hide app icon what that does is if you turn that off you will still be able to do the winterboard settings but you will also have the winterboard icon on your springboard 
Um, I believe that if you do have the settings hack, I don't think you need the winter board icon on your springboard. But if you still want it, you can keep it. And then logs, that's just if you want to keep logs of everything, which I really don't see a point to. Unless you're like a big person or whatever. But okay. So the themes, everything works normally. As you see. Um, I'll go ahead and take my theme off the metal theme that I am still working on. I will probably have it done anytime this week with springboard wise. And then I'm going to have um, some UI stuff later on. Just for a little heads up. Now we're going to wait for that to respring. As you see, because I didn't turn off any of that other stuff. But now my springboard is normal. So it's a nice little hack um, to keep everything organized into your settings application. So if you're like OCD about your phone, I'm not going to say any names. Michael DAC7. Um, if you're really OCD about everything, it's a really good way to keep everything organized and easy to follow. So, yeah, everybody, this is Phil from iPodTouchBala.com. Um, comment, rate, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And even if you didn't, go ahead and comment, rate, comment and rate. Um, you don't have to subscribe, but it's whatever. Um, and I'll just see you guys in the next video, which will most likely be on Thursday before I leave for my trip. Because I'm leaving Thursday, coming back next Monday. So next Monday or Tuesday, be expecting a new review. Most likely will be a case review. Um, either case or app, don't know yet. Might be an app review, but I doubt it. It'll probably be a case review. So yeah, guys, Phil here, and I will see you guys later.